And here we are after a weekend of fantastic play. The first shot of the finals comes from the Blue Alliance. It's Panther Robotics answered quickly by Red, but then doubled down by the Shockwave and answered again by 2910. Drivers now have control of very evenly matched game. That shows you why these teams deserve to be right here in the finals. More than two minutes on the clock. The Blue Alliance an autonomous action gives them the early lead. But Red is not to go down without a fight as your number one seeded Jack in the Bot. They pile up the power cubes, taking the scale for Red. Each side holding their own switch while the Blue Alliance machine known as Panther Robotics, the number three seeded team tonight, they raise the stakes here with another power cube for their side, but it's not yet enough. With a little bit of work though, it looks like Jack in the Bot misses a shot. And it's 1983, the Skunks who spill a cube and the scale finally tips to the Blue. Blue Alliance in the lead at this point. No one has yet to play a power up. Right now, the Blue Alliance holding their switch. The Red Alliance holding theirs. One point per second for each of those. With a minute to play, the Red Alliance continues to hold the scale. And they just about knock another one off as 1983 tries to find more space to stash these power cubes. One minute left to play, 45-12. It's your BearBots in blue. They have exhausted their supply of power cubes on their side of the field. The BearBots looking a little confused as they now need to hunt down yet another game piece. 43 seconds left and we're still missing all three power-ups. Ladies and gentlemen, a lot of opportunity for the scores to shift with the Red Alliance and a slight lead as Blue answers with a 30-point levitate. 1983 now in possession as the Blue Alliance spills the scale. And just like that, it may yet be over for their scale ownership in the last 18 seconds of the match. The Red Alliance holds steady, but now it's time to climb as Jack in the Bot goes up and they miss their first attempt, second attempt, third attempt. The pressure's on for Jack in the Bot but they come through big in the final moments. What a finale to our very first finals match here in Glacier Peak. Jack in the bot coming up big when it counts. They've shown that they can handle the pressure. We're gonna tally the scores and let you know what to expect as we prepare for final match number two coming up in a few moments. Ladies and gentlemen, your scores have been calculated and very strategic use of power up play in this last match, the first of our final series. Both alliances playing the levitate power up, which earned them a climb. Both alliances successfully climbing in addition to that. Quite the play there here between our first seated red alliance and our third seated blue alliance. With all of it on the line, the scores did change as we calculated your final results. So direct your attention to the display for the exciting results of finals match number one. In a climactic victory, the Red Alliance takes the win. Well played with a 378 point victory. Excellent work in our very first finals match, but the question remains, with four power-ups unplayed, 
Would that have made a difference? Strategy now being reconsidered in about the next six minutes while we take a field timeout to give our teams time to power up their batteries and recharge their compressors. We will be back with the next in our series of final matches in just a moment. <laughs> 